All right, y'all. Good evening. This is Big Rich. I heard some bad news today. You know what I'm saying? And um, it's basically bad news for Devin Haney. And I kind of knew this was happening. And I knew, you know what I'm saying, this could possibly happen because of the way Cambosa started talking towards the end. I mean, he was talking good when I was there. I actually interviewed him. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, you never know with these guys. They say a whole lot of things before they get the belt. And once they get the belt, they realize how much power they have now. And they always switch up. You know what I mean? Um, the way I feel about the situation is uh, if Devin Haney go down there and if he at least fights and if he loses because of um, um, Australia is known for taking fights from fighters. They took a fight from Manny Pacquiao and they probably would take a fight from Devin, but at least he fought him. You know what I mean? Um, I know Devin Haney, it would be a damn good fight. You know what I'm saying? Probably 50-50 because Cambosas can't fight. And I had Cambosas beating Lopez. I, I made a place to bet in Vegas. I have receipts to prove that. You know what I'm saying? But it looks like uh, Cambosas is trying to fight Lomachenko. And it looks like he's willing to make that fight. And Bob Herriam is trying to make some money. And he see that money potential with those 80,000 fans in Australia. And he's trying to, he's going to make that bet. This fight with uh, Comey looked like Comey, uh, Richard Comey looked like he was drained. and He didn't even look right. I mean, look at too skinny. Lomachenko's going to beat the brakes off him tonight. You know what I'm saying? But it's just a fact that it's amazing how, you know what I'm saying, all these guys, you know what I'm saying, everybody is so afraid to fight Devin Haney. You know what I'm saying? It is everybody in boxing. You know what I'm saying? I am literally... I went to the, the Jojo Diaz fight. Jojo Diaz is a great fight. And he fought a great fight. Don't get it twisted. That Devin Haney was no walk in the park. People walking around here thinking it was a walk in the park. Jojo Diaz fought a hell of a fight. It's just Devin Haney outboxed him in terms of uh, outpointing him, outboxed him, you know what I'm saying, the whole nine yards. But it, it, uh, it could have went. I can't say it could have went either way. But, you know what I'm saying, Devin Haney, if he wasn't on his shit, he would have lost that fight. Because that's how good Jojo Diaz is. And I take my hats off to Jojo Diaz. And he's going to be a good champion uh, again one day. You know what I'm saying? Because he's going to go back to the drawing boards. And, and he's a hell of a fighter. You know what I'm saying? That's a fact. You know what I mean? Um, another thing I have to mention. Since I haven't mentioned it. Um, Cruz, he's a good fighter. You know what I mean? Um, and in reality, you know, people want to say, oh... Uh, Tank lost. Tank didn't lose that fight. Tank beat the brakes off that motherfucker with one hand. That's a fact. I was there. I was at the fight. Okay. Cruz won about four rounds. You know what I mean? And he's a good fighter. He's a, and, and I guarantee you Cruz will run through that whole 135. Uh, there he'll run through the whole list. Because a lot of them guys uh, can dish it, but they can't take it. And a lot of them ain't got chins like that. And Cruz is going to definitely check your chin. You better believe that. He's going to check your chin. And if he fight Ryan Garcia, Ryan Garcia, you better take a two-month fight before you do all that talking and get back in the ring. You've been out of the ring for a while. You just stay stay put. But bad news for Devin Haney. It's bad. I already knew it was coming. You know what I mean? He probably won't end up with that fight. And the funny thing is that uh, Cambosa said that, you know what I'm saying, that he would fight Devin Haney. And you know what I'm saying? Uh, after After this fight, and uh, I believed him, you know what I'm saying? But, you know, money talks now. You're talking about, um, you're not talking about million dollars no more. You know what I mean? You're talking about five, ten, twenty million dollars that's on the table, potentially, with pay-per-view, Australia, you know what I mean? Just alone, if those 80,000 people showed up, that's 10 million, 10, 20 million right there. You know what I mean? So the money is heavy on the table, you know what I mean? And, um, you know, it's another duck. I knew it was going to happen. You know, people do all that talking. You know what I'm saying? But when it comes down to it, all the boxing is scared to fight Devin Haney. That's crazy to me. You know what I mean? Um, honestly, if he don't get that fight, if, if Devin don't get that fight, I think Devin needs to push for that fight against Tank. Fuck it. You know what I mean? Tank, you know what I mean? As soon as your, heel, your, your hand heal and it gets back together, you need to fight Devin Haney. Fuck it. Put y'all together. So nobody else don't want to fight. You know what I mean? And, and Floyd need to make that fight. This is Big Rich. Let's debate. Hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel.